Hey, how's it going? It's Jasper from No More Codes here. Um, and in today's software tutorial, we'll learn how to calculate and display um, average ratings that your users have submitted on software um, with formula and also Airtable automation. In my previous tutorials, we covered how we can enable users to comment and also submit a rating to a specific linked uh, data record. And this is a follow-up tutorial to that. Um, so I won't go through the details of um, how you can set up the linked record nor submitting ratings. So um, if, you're, if you want to learn how to do those, um, check out my previous tutorials. Um, but I will do a quick run through of the end result and a um, quick overview of the setup. Here um, we have the simple cafe list um, application that we have been using for previous tutorials. Um, users can go into a specific cafe's details page and comment and also submit ratings. In this database, we have a table for all the cafes and one of the fields is overall rating, which is where our final average rating result is going into um, and another table for all the comments and ratings. These two tables are linked. So to calculate the average rating of a cafe, we need to add a lookup field to this linked comment record um, on this cafe table. The field we're going to toggle is the ratings field. And you can see that we now have a list of numbers, uh, which are all the ratings that um, users have submitted uh, for this specific cafe. Once we have all the ratings data, we will make a new field and we will call this field average. The field type will be formula and the formula we're going to use is average. The field will, uh, the value we'll put inside the bracket is the lookup field, um, rating from comment, which we just added. As you can see, the formula automatically calculates the average and round it to the closest whole number. However, the number calculator from this field cannot be read um, from the software side um, because it is not in the right type. We are using formula type here and the software, um, on the software side, it will only display ratings if it is in a rating type. Um, this is why we have an average rating field here um, to put our average rating. And our goal here right now is to update this field with the value that we got from this formula. So the next thing we're going to do is to set up an Airtable automation to do that for us. And the trigger we will select is going to be when record is updated. Table is cafe and the field we want to watch is average because we want this automation to run every time the average is calculated and updated. And we will do a quick test. It worked. Um, now we want to add an action which in our case is update record um, because we want to update the overall rating. The table is cafe as well. The record ID is from step one, it's from trigger step, and we'll select Airtable ID here. And the field we want to update is overall rating. The value we're going to update it to is from step one, and we select average, Let's do a quick test and the test worked. So let's toggle this automation to make sure that it is on. Now let's go back to Software Studio side. Uh, we need to make sure that we have our ratings filled or hooked up um, to our overall ratings, which they are right now. Um, let's give it a test. Um, let's say I come in here, I submit another comment and rating here. And once it is refreshed, uh, you will see the rating has gone up for Watch House. Um, and there you have it. Um, this is how you can calculate and show average ratings on your software application. Um, hope this tutorial helped. Um, if it did, please like and subscribe or even share these. Um, and if you have something that you, uh, something else that you want to learn, um, leave a comment down below uh, and if you need help with building your site or software application or, or anything related to no code you can book a free consultation with me through my uh, email or my website down below um, until next time ciao